Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Files here from Pixie Notch NZ and today I am having a very interesting topic to discuss. What you do when you're making a booking for a wedding photo shoot. All I have noticed is there are two major responsibilities. One from the photographer to the client and client to the photographer. We're going to discuss both of this. Let's start with the responsibility of a client before making a booking for a wedding photograph. We are going to discuss both the responsibilities in this video. Let's begin. From the responsibility of a client towards the photographer, there are three major responsibilities I believe that needs to be met before the day of photo shoot. The very first thing is giving time to your photographer so he understands what's the um, what's the event is all about what is the expectations of the uh, couple and the family members because he has to do all the plannings so make sure you have some time allocated before your wedding so your photographer um, has a plan of action for the day of the event but the second thing is um, introducing your photographer to your family members because he will know you because you have done the booking for the event but he might not know your family members who are close to you so at least the minimal is you need to um, make them aware who are the close family members at least on the day of the wedding or at the day of the event um, so that these people are the important people should not be missing out from the photograph and the photographer knows who are they he's gonna make sure that he's gonna have them in the frame now third one this is very very important um, the clients should inform their friends and family members not to disturb the photographer while doing the photo shoot I know everyone wants a post for their Instagram instantly and all they do is hand over their phone to the photographer and say can you just click some photos well photographer is not gonna say no to that but the client has paid hundreds of dollars probably thousands of dollars to book the shoot so it's really important that he focuses on the capturing of moments not taking photos for someone's Instagram post if that happens he gets distracted and he will lose focus and some of the important moments gonna be getting missed out so it's really important to let your family and friends know not to ask that kind of request from a photographer if you want a perfect photography session for your event now let's talk about the responsibilities of a photographer towards the client the very first thing the photographer has to do is pre preparation he has to be ready for the day of the event he has to know the number of people coming to the event what is expected out of the client what are the poses they are comfortable with talk to your clients a lot and get to know them their family and their expectations secondly it's the photographer's responsibility it's a kind of photographers and the clients responsibility both to at least make an effort to go to the venue so you see how big is the venue where is the exact lighting source coming in you can plan that the photographer can plan properly where he's going to set up his lightings his cameras and all those other factors the other responsibility of the photographer is since he has been familiarized with the family members he has to take some candid moments captured in his camera for the bride Groom, their family members and all the friends around they have to walk around sneak take some photos uh, so these are very important factors as it brings out the life in the after photography so when you're presenting your album to the client they have all the moments captured throughout the event making sure the time of ceremony is known by the phot photographer um, they know what are the what are the different ceremonies happening what's the location because sometimes a ceremony happens in some place and then the, the bride and the groom moves to a different place so you have to make sure that you have well communicated with the clients and you are present at every single moment capturing those precious moments for them all right guys finally 
the very important thing for a photographer is to maintain professionalism throughout their journey from the day they meet the client till the day they delivered all the photos and after so basically you have to dress very well you have to be professional you have to be very transparent and very communicative you have to make sure all the communications is happening in time and making sure you can help the client as much as possible to understand all the concept because as a photographer you do this all the time every day but the clients it is once in a lifetime moment so please make sure you have given special attention to all the details of your clients all right thank you so much i hope this made some sense while making a booking for uh, wedding photography and i'm gonna be making more interesting videos please like subscribe and share my channel and i will see you next time till then you guys take care Thank you.